guys, we were waking up here at Willow Springs. I'm at Balcony, and just over the hill there is Horse Thief, and right down there is Streets. I got here late last night, got here about 11.06, not kidding. Uh, there's some COVID stuff here we'll be observing. That is happening. We've got a cool little A. That's 14. They're already out. And yeah, it's going to be a good day, guys. So thanks for joining us if you're just tuning into the channel. I'm NTG Builds, and this is Tiffany. She is a 1990 Mazda Miata. We have made her into a Miata cart. We have a fast forward supercharger. We run E85. We're running 15 pounds of boost right now. And we're pushing 209.7 to the rear. Being a little restricted by a couple things that we know about and we're gonna fix them. But yeah, that's what we've done. It's kind of just spiraled out of control into the most fun you could have. So thanks for joining us and check out some of the shredding from today. Oh shoot, that was recording the whole time. <clears throat> wow, this is amazing. That is some serious tire right here. Serious. Six inches. That's what she said. So this looks a lot bigger on the videos. That is also a thing she said. Definitely a bunch of headlights have tagged this. Bunches. <laughs> tires I'm running here these uh, 195 60 15s they're a lot taller than I'm used to but I actually don't mind it now that I've adjusted the car to be able to have them fit it's pretty good I am gonna stiffen up the coilovers and so it's at 22 so I'm gonna go six over and then I'm gonna do six over on this side and we're just gonna see what it is. It's a pretty drastic number. So we're now at 28, which means we'll still have another eight to click if we need to, just to see what's up. But Tiffany's getting a little hot. I was gonna change this out, but I like this. This, once this blows, I know it's time for me to stop. Because I get caught in the moment, and I don't wanna stop. So that's one of the, one of the indicators. Um, I don't know if these guys are gonna go run. If not, I'm gonna go run. Everybody else is kind of doing their lunch thing. I still have a few more hours so I can eat. So I will be getting some track time. I think I'm about ready to send it into this um, the end here. Just feeling it out. Got the e-brake back, that's working. Um, just getting some good seat time and not really having to go by any program. There is a line here and I'm um, really getting the Mongees down too, which I like, some really drastic ones, which I really, really do like. So, um, overall, balcony is what I hoped it would be, but more actually. 
and we're just chilling. Really, really calm day, worth it. And I'm now a member of uh, Willow Springs International Raceway, so I can come here anytime, and I will. not have that problem but uh, I'll probably do a little a couple more runs I might be the only person here and I'll camp here tonight and then we'll head to Torco and NRG in the morning here's a little crazy but who cares we're out here drifting we'll check the plugs we had a plug foul out we're gonna take this pull down and see what's up with that uh, sound like somebody out down on streets actually I keep seeing some Miatas running around but uh, it's the perfect time to get some awesome shots I wish she was driving there seems to be an oil pressure issue and I don't want to find out the hard way again even though I think it might have already happened but the balcony has lived up to everything I had hoped it would be <clears throat> I was finally able to lean in and fully set into this turn here. And I think these are my tracks. These are the last freshies that are here. But then I'm pretty sure, but it could not be. I could be making all this up, but I didn't go very deep. So I feel like this, but this might be, this looks like actually, this is Josh's 
tires, tracks, not mine. But in the video, it looked pretty good. Hopefully, you guys can see I didn't have anybody use this camera. Oh, actually, I did, but it was a garbage run. So, there's that. Um, we got some on the potato phone, fire run, and I got a vertical view of an awesome run, I guess. We had a fuel issue. With the fuel issue, caused something to get hot. When something got hot, caused something to happen. And now I have very low, very, very non-existent oil pressure. Give a little bit of gas, it bumps it up to like 20. So, I'm going to get loaded up on the car trailer because I don't want to do it later. I know it runs right now. We'll get it up there. Um, and we'll deal with what it is. That's what it is. Drift life. You know it if you've lived it. <clears throat> and if you want to live it, get ready to know that <clears throat> you're going to break your stuff. So, already sourcing things that it could be. We'll go. I'll get Brandon from Silly Slow. He'll come over. Tell me what I did wrong. <clears throat> Help me come up with a plan to fix it. And then hopefully we can make it to Andy's Tire Slay Day on July 4th. Because now, with the new coilovers from K-Sport, with them dialed in, e-brake fixed, and all the new pads all the way around, I think I'm kind of figuring it out. And so I know that I could just smash grains, just smash it. And do really well so we're gonna get there all right we're finishing it up here at um balcony willow springs great day tiffany has a boo-boo i'm gonna figure it out won't be able to drive it in our g tomorrow hopefully still stop by let them see or not let them let me see the facility and say hi which would be cool to see jason we're going to torco driving the voodoo viper tomorrow that will be included in its own video yeah we set in we finally, you know, caught up the nerve to run this wall. I didn't get ultra, ultra close, but I fully committed, and um, that was what it takes to get it done. We're going to get loaded up, and then I'll take some beauty shots right now while we're here, and then we're out of here. Where are we? We're at the balcony, drifting, doing drift stuff. So if you like videos like this, if you wouldn't mind hitting the like button, that would be great consider subscribing that would be even better but either way we're gonna keep out here doing it tiffany says good night me and gg i say bye thank you for joining us we'll see you on the next adventure